I'm just down here along the Jurassic coast looking for fossils at low tide. The low tide today is at 4 p.m. and uh, you can see one of the ammonites washed out in a limestone block on the beach here just up ahead eroding away with the attrition of the sand and sea. I'll take you along here avoiding the green weedy slippery areas and show you quite an interesting part of the Jurassic coast. Here is a beautiful freshwater stream running down through the boulders on the beach. In amongst the chert rocks, I've spotted an agatized and silicified fossil wood fragment. This Cretaceous age fossil wood is very rare and it shows signs of Torito borings on the outside of the specimen. really gorgeous part of the Jurassic coast here with the Ammonite pavement west of Lyme Regis quite a bit further west than uh, most people walk out but the tide is very low today and I'm going to go right down onto the shoreline and uh, further down at low tide and see what's in the uh, rock pools see if there's any fossil material washed out into these rock pools the sea's been doing a lot of work recently big seas washing the mudslides and bringing material down onto the beach. Later on in the video I'll play you some of the last couple of days finds that I've made along here. Some quite nice little backbones, one of an ichthyosaur, one of a plesiosaur. Lovely rock pools here today to look at. There's the sea down there in the distance. I shall walk on a bit here and get onto one of the ledges that will take me through this area and uh, we can see some very nice areas where the uh, lias ledges jut out so i'm just walking down here into the sun quite a lot of uh, limpets on the rocks here at low tide a really beautiful area of the jurassic coast you can see the rock pool there streaming out down towards the sea it's a beautiful stretch of the Jurassic coastline here with the uh, Cretaceous rocks you can see all eroding down onto the shoreline. Plenty of sea urchin fossil finds to be made along this uh, shoreline. And like I said at low tide there's good pockets on the beach to find the uh, small backbones of the ichthyosaur in. Fossil shells, crinoid stems and uh, lots of fossil fragments of ammonites that will shout. So much fun to be had here at low tide, fossicking around amongst the rocks. This is a wonderful sea urchin fossil that I've spotted preserved in flint. So you've got the sun going down in the west over there along the Jurassic coast. A really beautiful afternoon it's been and I'm going to show you right at the end of the video a couple of the fossils that I found in rock pools over the last couple of days out here. Looking for some fossil treasures in rock pools at low tide is great fun. Here I've spotted the worn backbone of a plesiosaur. You can see the plesiosaur centrum looks good, plus a bit of the neural arch. This vertebra is from an ichthyosaur, and these fossils can be found along the Jurassic coast at low tide. Finally, this last fossil find to show you is a fossil shark coprolite with fish scale inclusions, a slight spiral crease to the back of it, and I assume it's not an ichthyosaur coprolite, 
as the high shark had a spiral intestine.